A type is speed in words per minute over a four minute interval is given by the function w t is minus 60 squared plus 12 t plus 90 for t between 0 to 4, where t is the num number of minutes from the beginning of the interval. So this is a four minute interval. So first let us understand this graphically and then we'll use calculus first uh, later. So y or function w t or words per minute is a function of time is minus 60 squared plus 12t plus 90. So let us make up a table. So this is t and this is a words as a function of time. So let us say 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So let's use a calculator to write, uh, find these values. So go to table and type in the equation minus 6x squared plus 12x plus 90. That's not 9, plus 90. Okay, so just to have a sense of what's happening, I'll go from 0 to 4, less than 4 actually. So I'll go, let us go 0 to 4. Yeah, it doesn't matter, it will not include 4. Step of 1. So you start at 90 minutes, then 96, then 90, 72. So it's 90, 96, 92, 90, 96, 90, 72. So you start at 90, okay, then you reach, I keep forgetting, 96. Okay, then you come back at 90, and then you're coming back to 72. And at 4 minutes, of course, 4 should not be included, it is 42. So, 4 minutes, it's 42. So, actually, you can include only this much, okay? This is can only be included. So, let's graph this so we know the range. So, go to graph, and uh, I have to scroll like this, and then I know the scale. So, G, F3, I'll go from 0 to 4, or 0 to 4 would do, yeah. 0 to 4, step of 1, and I'll go from 0 to 100. Okay, scale of 10 would do, and then draw the graph. So this is a graph, okay? So you start at 90, and you increase your speed, and you reach the maximum. So let's go GSOL, maximum. Let's, so after one minute, you reach the maximum. So we already got that in the table. So <clears throat> yeah. Let's use calculus now. This is your answer. We already know the answer. So now let's use calculus. Okay. So you may wonder why do we need calculus? Because this is a need number. So it can all it's not it's always not a need answer like this. So let me write the notation. So W W T or a words per minute as a function of time is minus sixty squared plus uh, so let's draw the graph. Okay, so here the graph was like this, a sketch of the graph. Always good to have a graphical understanding. So the graph looked like this. So it started at, it went better than this. So this is slightly goes up from here. Okay, so this is at 90, at 0, at 0 times 0. So this is your time, t time, and this is words per minute. So, and when time is zero, when time is zero, the type has a speed of 90. That's not included. And this, this is one minute where you get the maximum speed. Okay, so this is 1 comma 96. Okay, so this is, function is minus plus 12t plus 90. So this is a notation you need to, W dash T, this is derivative. This is a notation for the gradient or dy by, dy by dx. So this is dy by dt. Okay, so if this was y, suppose this was y, this is the same as saying this is dy by dt. And W dash T is same thing. So you drop the power down, so that is minus 6 times 2 t to the power 1 plus the power of t is 1, so this is 12 times 1, t to the power 0. 
So your gradient function W T is this is minus twelve T plus twelve. Minus twelve T plus twelve. And this I'm going to set this equal to zero because you will know at the maximum you have the gradient of zero. So this is minus twelve T. Uh, solving this equation is equal to minus twelve. So dividing both sides by minus twelve. T is minus 12 divided by minus 12, which is 1. So after one minute, she reaches the maximum speed, and then it's dropping down. So you can now say, put this back in this equation. You can see the maximum speed that you can do yourself. Maximum speed is 96 words per words per minute, WPM.